Do Kwon is unlikely to face prison time for $60 billion USD worth grid to wipe out. Fines and lawsuits are more likely. So, troubles are coming for Terra Luna creator Do Kwon and the team. Can they actually succeed or not? I'm not so bullish, but let's try to find out. Welcome to Crypto Prodigy YouTube channel, the place where you can find out. Everything you want to know, everything you have to know about your favorite coin and about your favorite token. And in today's video, that's right, guys, we're going to talk about Terra Classic, the old blockchain, and Terra 2.0, now called Luna. The old one is now Lu UNC, L U N C. But is that a good idea or not to go with a brand new blockchain? Let's try to find out. Well, some great things are coming on Terra 2.0, but first thing first, as you can see here, current price of Terra Classic is 0.407146. You don't need me. To, you don't need me to tell you how far we are. From, we are from the all-time high. Will Terra Classic ever reaches the all-time high? The answer is no. 100% no. Take a look at the, look at the circulating supply after Deepak. They had to mint a lot of them, and that call that caused the crash of Terra Classic. So if you expect Terra Classic to reach it. To reach $100 or more, that's not gonna happen. Is there a chance to remove zero or two? Maybe, but well, we're going to talk about that in a moment. Speaking about Terra 2.0, current price is $4.25. So, as you can see here, far away from the all time high, uh, which happened at the start, we can see that dump right away when people decided to sell their those coins after uh, that airdrop so what does that mean that means that people do not trust the project anymore however on the other side we have some great uh, things that can help uh, terra 2.0 to build a brand new and even stronger ecosystem for example stake is now live on terra money stake is a liquid staking protocol for luna you can stake directly on liquid liquid staking app and the protocol all the compounds your staking rewards for uh, for you zero fees thanks to larry and pfc validator one more thing retrograde 2 is coming to terra soon so some great things are happening here on terra 2.0 but the problem is that they basically abandoned the old blockchain yes you can see some relisting uh, for terra classic but Will there be any development? Hmm, I'm not so sure. We'll take a look at this before we can go to that part. TA fam, uh, TFM, we appreciate and thank Terra community for recognition of our work on Terra Classic and for including us as essential app on Terra 2.0. Excited to bring the most advanced aggregation of both token and NFT liquidity to Terra 2.0 plus major new trading functions seen nowhere before. So what do we have here? Uh, new projects are coming on Terra 2.0, but it means that Terra 1.0, Terra Classic, is going to be abandoned uh, of, uh, let's say, many of the projects of the old ecosystem. So, one more thing, we come money on Terra 2.0 to empower the ecosystem, we is the fastest and cheapest way to launch new projects on Terra 2.0 and mitigate risks for investors so that's it some great things are coming this is not everything that is happening on terra 2.0 will that be enough to to push the price of terra 2.0 uh, maybe can that push the price of terra 1.0 terra classic no because nothing is happening on the old blockchain so for some day trading uh, speaking about terra classic is not really a bad solution but please be careful because you can easily drop out from that trade. So you can see many rebounds here. Take a look at this. However, please be careful. So you can easily, instead of waiting for a new rebound, you can go down. So these uh, drops could be really, uh, really tough if you want to do some scalping. So please be careful with that. If you want to play, please play, but only with the amount you are ready to lose so speaking about that uh, could Terra reach at least one dollar well probably not because nothing is happening and Do Kwon and the team da don't have any plan for burning so that's the biggest mistake at least they think speaking about Terra 2.0 so let's pretend that not happened with Terra Classic and now we're going to build a new blockchain so uh, taking a look at the chart doesn't mean a lot 
Uh, yes, many great projects are coming, but it doesn't mean a lot because there is lack of trust in the team. People do not believe Doquan and uh, Terra Foundation, so that's why we're going down and down. Of course, we have to take into consideration that uh, the whole market is going down. However, uh, will Terra ever uh, be the Terra it used to be? I'm not so confident about that. So guys, let me know in the comment what you think about Terra and Terra Classic and please, until next video, please invest smart.